morning, you guys. Happy Friday, Prayer Circle Friday. Um, today, I am going to be in constant prayer and praying over food that I am going to be making uh, today for a new widow in uh, my church. And um, her name is Renee. If you would like to pray for her, uh, she has experienced a lot of grief. She has lost almost ooh, everyone who's been important to her. And uh, a week ago today, she lost her, her one, her beloved, her husband, her best friend, her other half. So I'm gonna go see her today and I'm gonna sit with her in this valley. I'm gonna pray with her and I'm gonna try to nourish her body. So um, today's video is gonna look a little different for a prayer circle Friday. Um, if you have a prayer request, leave them down below so I can pray for you and others can pray for you. Um, I'm not going to say my prayer for Renee here because I'll cry. Um, but I, I figured I would uh, turn on the camera and bring you along with me maybe for a little bit today as we um, cook her a meal to help nourish her body, her strength, at least physically. And hope she knows that the Lord has her, is covering her. So, I'm gonna get you up on a tripod and we're gonna start by making her
Fire in the rain It's the smile within the pain It's the logic but insane You cannot know from where it came It's the way you cross the floor Before you head on out the door The figure on the wall So many times I hear the call It's the silence of the room The way you turn before you bloom Another shadow for the blind I think I'm gonna lose my mind I 
heart to many of us here A crowded planet full of fear It's not the way it's meant to be We should be happy living free Although I'm running up a hill I feel I'm always standing still Okay, so I thought I would show you really quick uh, what I'm going to take to our house. So I have eight Texas Roadhouse rolls with two of the honey cinnamon butters wrapped in that bag for her. Um, let me see, we'll start here. Barbecue chicken, that's going to be her main dish and that's with my homemade almost sweet baby raised barbecue sauce with a side of my home canned green beans. Um, I've got barbecue baked beans to go with that. I've got the homemade mac and cheese that she can just put right in the oven um, to go with it. I also have chili uh, with the toppings for her so that she can have some cheese and some green onion on top. So it's kind of like a whole <laughs> Texas Roadhouse uh, themed dinner here. Um, and then um, I made her a caramel apple uh, dump cake using my home canned apple pie filling. And then I'm also sending her, um, or dropping off to her, um, some of the uh, bourbon maple vanilla jelly so she can just have some toast and jelly in the, um, in the morning. And then I'm gonna drop off two dozen eggs. So I got her a little bit of every color. And this way, you know, I was gonna make a breakfast casserole for her, but I don't, you know, everyone grieves differently. And um, she might want comfort food. She might, she might not be hungry at all. This way, if she wants to make herself a scrambled egg or a couple hard boiled eggs, she can, some toast and jelly. And this food, um, it's snowing. We're supposed to get seven inches of snow uh, today. So she's probably not gonna wanna go anywhere this weekend. So I, I hope that this is an abundance for her um, and it'll get her through the weekend and um, give her some comfort is what I'm hoping. So I am going to pray over this food now and that it blesses her and that it nourishes her body, nourishes her spirit. Um, I hope she gets comfort from eating it. I hope she feels the love when she eats this. Um, and uh, I'm gonna just keep praying for her um, because being a widow or a widower, losing your person changes your entire life, your entire identity. Um, everything changes. And so um, if you don't mind, keeping my friend in your prayers. I would appreciate it. So I'm gonna pack all this up in a cooler bag and um, I'm gonna go jump in the shower really quickly and um, pack this up and take it to her. So, all right, God bless you guys and um, I'll be seeing you soon.